Okay, so for reading today, we're not reading a new chapter because we just finished our group of three chapters. So what we're going to do is on all of your work and the information for today's reading lesson are in the Monday packet. Um, I know that's confusing. I'm so sorry. Um, but I'm sorry. Um, so it's all in the Monday packet. So what you're going to do is, of course, you're watching this video. As soon as you're finished with this video, you will go ahead and on the first page of that packet is the chapter 16 through 18 summary you're just going to do the same thing remember number one you give a title make sure that you write the title correctly with correct capitalization and punctuation remember a chapter title is a minor work um, then for number two it's your summarizing what happened remember you need at least one or two sentences per chapter um, about what happened don't forget to write about a chapter then number three what is your favorite part of this section of the book make sure you tell me why and remember, because it was interesting or because it was funny is not a good reason why. You have to tell me why you thought it was funny or why you thought it was interesting. Be detailed. You need to fill up these lines. If you need to, you can use a separate sheet of paper or go on the back. Just don't forget, if you use a separate sheet of paper, don't forget to turn it in with um, this page. Then you'll notice normally the next activity is on the back, but in this case it's not because you actually get to have a lot of fun and be creative with this um, extra review. Because what you're gonna do is you are going to create your own demon. So you're gonna think about the demons that we've read about in these chapters, and you get to come up with your own demon. So be creative, be um, colorful, whatever. So in this big box, you're going to draw a picture of your demon. Um, use color use colored pencils you could even use marker if you want just if you use marker um, either put something between this page and the next page this is science from yesterday um, either like put a piece of paper or something between these papers so that the marker from the front doesn't go through onto this page or um, you can tear it out and do it that way but go ahead draw your picture you can use colored pencil, crayon, markers, whatever you have at home. I know you have your colored pencils. Your markers are here. I'm sorry about that. I'm going to try to get those out to you in some way in the next couple weeks. And then you're going to name your demon. After you draw your picture, you're going to name your demon. Or you can do it in whatever order you want, really. But here's where you name your demon. You say what their crime is, so what they do. Like we know that the, um, the senses taker, the one that we met in the last chapter, is um, he takes away, his crime is that he takes away people's senses. Um, so make sure that you um, list their crime, what they did. You do not have to write in complete sentences because you may not be able to fit them. And then here you get to put their height. Are they really, really tall and huge? Their height and weight. Are they really, really tall and huge like the gelatinous giant? Or are they small and tiny like the, oh my gosh, I can't remember his name, but you know, the little one, the demon of insincerity. That's who it was. So are they regular sized, like um, the terrible trivium, whatever. This is where you get to say what size, how tall are they, how much do they weigh. And then their description. So this is where you're describing their physical description. Other than height and weight, what do they look like? Are they, um, well, I wouldn't, you wouldn't say tall and skinny or short and fat or whatever. You would say things like they have slimy skin or furry eyes or whatever you want to say. Um, just you'll write your description here try to fit it in these lines That's another reason that you don't have to write in complete sentences so that you can fit your whole description here The reward is how much are you offering? How much money are you offering or maybe you're offering something other than money? For the capture of this demon and then contact is where you put your name number and date Okay, if you have any questions about that uh, make sure to reach out to me today on Skype or FaceTime or text or email or however, whatever's easiest for you, and I can help you if you're a little confused or have more questions. Okay, go ahead and get started on that. Have fun with the demon. Um, I'm excited to see all of yours. Oops, that's not it. I'm excited to see all of your demons. Um, this is usually a really fun project, and I just love seeing everybody's creativity. Um, so go wild. Just try to fit it all on this page. Okay, go ahead.